forecast from KTVO. Expect more. Have a, a dense fog advisory issued until midnight for northeast Missouri. But again, southeast Iowa is, is, is seeing some foggy conditions as well. In fact, visibility uh, is less than 100 feet. So please be very careful. We do have some light rain across the area. And that will be changing over to a little bit of a wintry mix as we're heading into midnight and after midnight as temperatures continue to fall. Uh, regional satellite radar. We did see a little bit of freezing drizzle this morning, but the bulk of the activity was off to our east and our south uh, as they saw heavier rain and embedded thunderstorms. And then as we're heading into the evening hours, what we're dealing with right now is the foggy conditions. Now, as temperatures are right now actually warming up 39 degrees at the Kirksville Regional Airport, uh, we did have reports a little bit earlier that was some a little bit of light rain activity. Winds are calm right now. Dew point 38. Relative humidity levels at 96 percent. As home with 34 and cloudy skies. Winds are out of the south at 5 miles per hour. Dew point 33. And relative humidity levels at 96 percent. Temperatures varying quite a bit. 36 in Fairfield. Uh, again, 34 in Ottumwa, but Macon, 43 degrees. Factor in those winds, even though they are light, it still feels a little bit colder out there. It feels like 30 degrees in Ottumwa, Kirksville, 39, and Centerville feels like 33 degrees. Well, for tonight, overnight lows around 27 degrees. So, again, as temperatures continue to fall, and we do have some light drizzle across the area that will be changing over to a rain-snow mix, and then again, we do have that dense fog uh, that will continue through the midnight time frame. Winds will remain out of the west at 5 to 15 miles per hour. Now for tomorrow, the good news is we are going to see above normal temperatures once again around 38 degrees and more sunshine. Mix of sun and clouds on your Saturday, though it will be blustery. Winds around the west 10 to 15 with gusts near 20 miles per hour. And then for tomorrow night, mostly clear skies. Overnight lows around 24 degrees with brisk winds. Uh, actually switching to the southwest 5 to 15, and that's good because that's going to have a nice impact on our Sunday. Temperatures, look at this, 46 degrees, very mild for this time of year. 28 on Sunday night. Monday, a little bit cooler, about 10 degrees cooler. In fact, 36 degrees on Monday, 35 Tuesday with partly sunny skies. And Wednesday, right at the freezing mark, around 32 degrees with mostly sunny skies. Overnight lows for the weekend in the mid to upper 20s. And then back down into the teens Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. Of course, anytime, check us out 24-7 at heartlandconnection.com. That fog is very dense out there. It's really thick. You can cut it with a knife. So, again, mm -hmm. just be very careful. Uh, you've got the slick roads. Yep. As temperatures continue to fall, it, they're going to freeze. And then the foggy conditions. Drive slowly with your low 